Good morning everyone, it is day 3 of being in Langkali. It's currently 7am, I woke up at like 6 something and got ready because we're going island hopping. Why am I wearing- I need to take this one off. But we're going island hopping, so that's why we're all ready. This is like what I'm wearing. Um, we're gonna go have breakfast now. And then after breakfast, we're gonna leave. It's like a 30 minute drive. And yeah, can you guys hear the waves in the background? It's so, like, so beautiful. Also, we are staying at Lankapuri, the hotel, but there are like villas. I think it's called the villa down there. Okay, I'll see you guys when breakfast. Yeah. We're going in a bat cave and they gave us a flashlight. There's no guide. There's no flash. There's no one guiding us, so we don't know what. <laughs> They gave us a flashlight for a reason. Stop using the flash. <laughs> okay, so the first place that we went to was the Bat Caves. There was, like I said, no one guiding us, like a tour guide. So we kind of just managed on our own, which was completely fine. But the Bat Cave was super cool. This one was like filled with bats. There was some flying, as you guys can see in the video. And this place in is literally surrounded by mangroves, so the scenery was so beautiful. The second bat cave we went to was kind of just small and tight fitted. Um, so thank god there were no bats because that would have been scary, but it was still super fun and then we saw Monkeys and it was just so cool. The monkeys didn't attack us. Thank god and yeah, super fun Hey So after the bat cave, we then went to the fish farm to get some chicken skin for the eagle watching. So after we went to the fish farm, we then drove to the location where the eagles are located.
So what the tour guide did was he took the chicken skin and just put it in the river and then the eagles just came. I don't know how they knew we had chicken skin, but they came and then they just collected the chicken skin. It was so cool. We got to see them use those sharp talons and see them fly around us. It's what you would see in Nat Geo. gonna be our last island that they're bringing us to because that's what my mom said also if people are asking why we're not in the ocean it's because we are bleeding if you know you know so it, it kind of sucks but you know we still move this is the work we currently just took some pictures here i wanted to take some on my phone but i left my phone on the boat so we're using my mom's phone and the quality's not that good but it's okay Look, there's like caves. So we were at that island for like an hour, and then after the island, we then drove to this cave called the crocodile cave so we went through the crocodile cave and then we then drove back to the fish farm which was our last location before we went back home to the hotel fish farm tour guide was so nice he allowed us to feed the fishes and then he also taught us the different types of fishes they had there and he also allowed us i mean my siblings to feed his stingrays which was so cool They've also got a restaurant there, so if you'd like to eat some seafood that's fresh, definitely recommend going, but we didn't eat there because we weren't hungry, so we left. Guys, so it's now like 11.50, almost 12, and we just got done, just went off the boat. Squad's mobbing out. I think, what was your favorite part of the, of today? I think mine was the eagle. The eagle yeah, was yeah, really yeah. cool. Like, I don't know, it was just, like, people are probably like, literally what? But it was so cool. The fish one was also cool. Guys, yeah, so we're at Sushi King having lunch because we didn't eat yet. So. We were 
so hungry so we absolutely demolished the food in sushi king but after eating we then went back to our hotel and just chilled for a bit because it was raining and then we went to the beach hey guys so we just came back from the beach we were there for like two hours we were just like riding out the waves and just like vibing it's still like kind of gloomy like the last time it was like fully sunny was like the end of july yeah true. Hi, good morning everyone. It is day four, our last day here in Lankawi. I literally just woke up. It's like 7.15. It's currently like really cloudy. I'm so sad we're leaving. I'm gonna miss Lankawi so much. It was like a fever dream. It just like felt like a movie. It was just like really nice here. So I have like a sore throat don't know how I got it but yeah breakfast is downstairs so yeah also I've got no storage so that's why I barely like filmed yesterday which is just so sucky but also forgot to mention but Lanka Puri does include breakfast so they give you this breakfast voucher whenever you're having breakfast hey guys, we're at the beach right now um I'm journaling because I just have like a lot this morning to like reflect on and say. So I'm journaling. I do have my swimsuit on. I'm just gonna go to the beach after journaling. <laughs> Those waves are rough out there. It's gnarly out there, bro. <laughs> <laughs> now it's like drizzling like really badly. So we're going back to the room and then do some final packing and then we're gone. I journaled a little bit more when we went back to the hotel and basically after that i just showered did some final packing and then just chilled for a bit and then we went to our cousin's restaurant to say goodbye and then we left it's mom been out so we're leaving it's now like 10 and we're leaving which is just so sad this was our room by the way it was the junior suite i think yeah. Bye. This is a toilet. So sad. Okay, peace out. This is a fit. Pull and bear H and M. Yeah. <laughs> okay, bye. Let's go. I'm ready for my close up. Yeah, it's perfect timing. I want you to feel it everywhere. No, it's not a mystery We've been thinking about this Focused on each other's lips Made it back to... Stupid thing for me, oh my The ferry ride was like two hours Almost outro so i will right now thank you so much Langkawi. Langkawi was so beautiful as you guys saw it's mountains the mangroves everything the people were so kind and i can't wait to go back to Langkawi. it was just so beautiful and forever grateful for that holiday if you guys enjoyed make sure you like comment and if you aren't already subscribe what are you doing i checked my analytics on youtube studios and most of you guys aren't subscribed so subscribe i would appreciate it so much if you joined me on my youtube journey and yeah i'll see you guys next week or next week's video bye